transformation in three, three two, two, one. Feeling stuck and looking for inspiration and motivation? Then our series, Daily Dose of Inspiration, is just what you need. Tune in for a few minutes every Monday and Wednesday and prepare to transform your mindset, boost your productivity, and unlock your true potential. This series is part of our groundbreaking tips program, packed with years of research, success stories, and proven techniques. We've condensed all this valuable information into bite-sized, actionable content that will leave you wanting more. What sets us apart? Join us each week and experience how Daily Dose of Inspiration can change your mindset and how you perceive the world. Trust us, your personal development journey will never be the same again. Ready to discover information that can be a game changer in transforming your life? Let's get started. Hey, beautiful ladies. Welcome to another episode of Daily Dose of Inspiration. Have you ever looked in the mirror and felt like you didn't measure up? Maybe you've thought about getting cosmetic surgery to fit in with society's idea of beauty? Well, today we're going to talk about something that affects all of us, beauty standards. We'll look at why these standards exist, how they impact us, and most importantly, how we can break free from them. So let's get started on this journey of redefining beauty. Let's begin by talking about societal beauty norms. These are the unwritten rules that tell us what's considered attractive. For women, it often means being thin, young, and having perfect skin. For men, it's usually about being tall, muscular, and having a full head of hair. But where do these standards come from? A lot of it comes from the media, magazines, TV shows, and now social media. We're constantly bombarded with images of perfect bodies and faces. But here's the thing. These images are often heavily edited and unrealistic. They create a beauty standard that's impossible for most people to achieve. Now, let's talk about the growing obsession with cosmetic surgery. One procedure that's gained a lot of popularity recently is the Brazilian butt lift, or BBL. This surgery involves taking fat from other parts of the body and injecting it into the buttocks. It's become so common that some people refer to it as the BBL effect. But why are so many people getting this procedure? It's often because they feel pressure to have a certain body type. They see celebrities and influencers with curvy figures and want to look the same. But here's what many people don't know. These surgeries can be dangerous. In fact, the BBL has one of the highest mortality rates of any cosmetic procedure. Is it really worth risking your life to fit someone else's idea of beauty? Let's shift gears and talk about something positive, the beauty of aging women. Society often tells us that youth equals beauty. We see ads for anti-aging creams and treatments everywhere. But have you ever looked at an older woman and been struck by her beauty? There's something incredible about a face that shows years of laughter, wisdom, and experience. Think about actresses like Meryl Streep or Helen Mirren. They're in their 70s and still considered some of the most beautiful women in Hollywood. That's because true beauty comes from confidence, kindness, and self-acceptance. These qualities only grow stronger as we age. So, how can we start to embrace our unique beauty? First, we need to recognize that beauty comes in all shapes, sizes, colors, and ages. Look around you. There's beauty and diversity. Next, try to limit your exposure to unrealistic beauty standards. Maybe unfollow accounts that make you feel bad about yourself. Instead, follow people who promote self-love and body positivity. Start practicing self-care that makes you feel good not just look good. This could be exercising, eating nutritious foods, or getting enough sleep. Remember, these things are about health, not about changing your appearance. Try to focus on the parts of yourself that you love. Maybe you have kind eyes or strong legs that carry you through your day. Celebrate these things. Another important step is to stop comparing yourself to others. Your beauty is unique to you. It doesn't look like anyone else's. 
Try this exercise. Every day, look in the mirror and say something positive about yourself. It might feel awkward at first, but over time, it can really boost your self-esteem. And remember, beauty isn't just about looks. It's about how you treat others, your passions, your kindness. These are the things that make you truly beautiful. Lastly, let's talk about how we can spread this message. If you hear someone criticizing their appearance, gently remind them of their unique beauty. Compliment people on things other than their looks. Tell your friend how much you admire their creativity or their sense of humor. And when you see diverse representations of beauty in the media, support it. Share these images. Talk about them with your friends. The more we normalize different types of beauty, the more inclusive our standards will become. So there you have it, ladies. We've talked about challenging beauty norms, the dangers of cosmetic surgery obsession, the beauty of aging, and how to embrace our unique beauty. Remember, you are beautiful just as you are. You don't need to change yourself to fit someone else's idea of beauty. Thanks for watching another episode of Daily Dose of Inspiration. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like and share it with someone who might need to hear this message. And we'd love to hear from you in the comments. What makes you feel beautiful? How do you practice self-love? Let's continue this conversation and support each other. And remember to subscribe and be a part of our 30-day confidence challenge starting on September 1st when you will see short videos with daily prompts. Daily Dose of Inspiration is posted on Mondays and Wednesdays, with a recap on Saturdays on Facebook and Instagram. Until next time, stay beautiful. Peace.